from the dead. I gave. I gave my life for thee. What hast thou given for me?
By the grace of God, we are going to the second administration for this morning. And it is a pool of blessing. We are going into the pool of blessing. I want you to prepare yourself to swim in that pool. God has prepared his servant for this great tax. In person of Pastor Akin Ogunson. Our hands for the Lord Jesus. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let us pray. Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you for this privilege that we have got to come again in your presence. Lord, as we go to examine the word of God, Holy Spirit, we ask that you will open our heart and mind to receive from you. Amen. That both the speaker and the hearer will be blessed today. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Lord, because of answer. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I have been given a topic to speak on giving. And uh, I am uh, by no means an expert to talk about this uh, Topic. Share the word of God. Apostle Paul said here, 
But I, this I say, he which soweth sparingly shall reap also sparingly, and he that soweth bountifully shall reap also bountifully. Every man according as he possesseth in his heart, so let him give, not grudgingly or of necessity, for God loves a cheerful giver. And God is able to make all grace abound towards you, that ye, always having all sufficiency in all things, may abound to every good work. This was by Apostle Paul. And then you can decide to go back into the Old Testament. And of course, that popular place in the book of Malachi, chapter 3, verse 6 to 12, we are still coming to that. About three, four, five years ago, some people came with an erroneous uh, doctrine. And the preachers actually. And we see them on social media. And they condemn tight. They condemn offering. And you see so many Christians align with them. And I was talking to one of my friends who uh, he's a zona pastor in one of the big church, and he said our tithe actually went down. And they actually they are still all over the social media. And, and I laughed and I told my friend that that means you have not taught your people the Bible all along. Because if your people knows the Bible, it is not another man's doctrine. It's the Bible. And some said, because Jesus made another statement in the book of uh, Matthew chapter tw uh, 26 that you will always have the poor amongst you. So that is a prediction that once you are destined to be poor, then there is nothing you can change. And then people relegate themselves. Why do I even need to give? Nothing happens because I have been destined to be poor. But I tell you, this statement by the Lord Jesus Christ is not a prediction about you. Yes, there will always be poor. Jesus was actually referring to the book of Deuteronomy chapter 15 verse 11 that amongst you there will always be poor. Yes? But it's your decision whether you want to be on this side or you want to be on that side. Giving. And look at that place again. 
Luke chapter 6 verse 38 I will read gradually He said Give Who made that statement? Jesus And it shall be given unto you Give Efifuni. I never saw a place that said, pray and it shall be given unto you. Yes, you can pray after you have given. He said, give and it shall be given unto you. And then he went on, he said, good measure. Press down and shaking together and running over shall men give to your bosom. Now what is giving? I quickly look at uh, uh, the uh, dictionary in the interpretation this morning. And he said that means give what is giving? And he said, disposing of property by voluntary transfer without receiving value in return. And don't forget, this is a sovereign declaration when he said, give. Yes, even though our Lord Jesus Christ made that statement. But the very, very important aspect of it is, is a principle that applies to both Christians and even non-Christians. That when you give, you get. Amen. Amen. So giving is the offering of something to God or to others or both. When you give to God, that could come in form of offering. It could come in form of tithe. And then to others, it could come in form of arms. You know, like the place we read, he said, there will always be the poor amongst us. So that could come in form of giving to others. But why do we give to God? I remember our Sunday school last year. Extensively, extensively treated this. Why do we give to God? He said it reflects our adoration or love to the Lord. Yes, or gratitude to God. And then we read in the book of Luke chapter 7 verse 36 to 50. I, I, I want to read that place. One of the Pharisees asked him over for a meal. And he went to the Pharisee's house and sat down at the dinner table. And just then, a woman of the village, the town harlot, having learned that Jesus was a guest in the home of the Pharisees, came with a bottle of a very expensive perfume and stood at his feet, weeping, raining tears on his face. Letting down her hairs, she dried his feet, she kissed them and anointed them with a perfume. And when the Pharisees who had invited him saw this, he said to himself, if this man was a prophet, I thought it he was, he would have known what kind of woman this is who is falling all over him. Jesus said to him, Simon, I have something to tell you. Oh, tell me. Two men were in debt to a banker. One owed 50, 100, 500 silver pieces and the other one 50. And neither of them could pay off. And the banker canceled both debts. Which of the two would be more grateful? Simon answered, I suppose the one who was forgiven the most. That's right, said Jesus. Then turning to the woman, but speaking to Simon, he said, do you see this woman? I came to your home. 
you provided no water for my feet, but she rained tears on my feet and dried them with her hair. You gave me no greeting, but from the time I arrived, she has not quit kissing my feet. You provided nothing for freshening up, but she has soothed my feet with perfume. Impressive, isn't it? She was forgiven for many, many sins. And so she is very, very grateful. If the forgiveness is minimal, the gratitude will be minimal. That is, uh, uh, I think, uh, the message interpretation. Mm, I mean, the version of the Bible I read. The version of the Bible okay. I've just read. He said, if the forgiveness is minimal, the gratitude is minimal. That means if you are very grateful to the Lord. You know, uh, the Jew mentioned the place. He said, uh, the book of uh, First uh, John chapter 3, he said, 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 He then you will know that nothing is too big to give to that Lord. And look at this woman. She brought an expensive perfume. Another, another, another book of the Bible said the, the worth of that uh, 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 perfume is worth a year's salary of a man. Amen. Amen. And because she has obtained forgiveness. The Bible called the, 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 you know, when I look at Luke, I, I, I saw what I did not see in other places. They call him the town's harlot. I share with the woman here. And she was able to obtain forgiveness. And she thought, what else could I give to this Lord? And she brought the biggest gift that she has got. And offer to the Lord. Secondly, he said, every man according as he proposed in his heart, so let him give. That means when you are coming, you see, some of us, when we come on Sunday, and deliberately some will, I mean, let's be factual, let's be practical. And what I'm saying affects all of us, including me. And I'm believing the Holy Spirit that after this message, our giving will change. Amen. And our blessings too will change. Amen. Amen. And some, deli some deliberately leave the big one at home. Hear what Apostle Paul said here. He, he said, said, every man according as he purposed in his heart. Okay. That means okay. it is not about Sunday to so offering time, blessing time, and then you dip your hands into your pocket and yeah, look everyone at it. That means giving is all about preparation. I'm an locum. You are out What am I going to give unto God this year? Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So he said, according as you have proposed in your heart, it's not until some of us you wait until the pastor begins to wind you up and say, Oh, or maybe some of you are even thinking after this message, I'm going to say, oh, Yeah, uh very December or do you? Come I'm not going to do that. Amen. Amen. So he said, every 
see man must propose in his heart. You must propose in your heart. So, some years ago, uh, I think uh, we were praying and uh, the G.O. said something. He said, the Lord said we should give an offering in Umitu Siodua. Go and think about it, what you want to give to the Lord. That I'm happy. You have to give free will of feel unto the Lord. I'm, I'm, I'm happy towards the Lord. Oh, cool. I want to tell you what do so long. That if they are happy towards the Lord, as many people that were happy towards the Lord, like, like, their, la, their life never remained the same. And that is what offering is about. And he said, when you get to First Corinthians chapter sixteen verse two, proportion. He said. Upon the first day of every week, let every one of you lay, I mean, lay by him in the store, as God has prospered him. Some of the new doctrine says it is Old Testament. Giving is all about Old Testament. But here, Apostle Paul was telling us that every first day of the week, let every one of you lay by him in the store, as God has prospered him. That means I know how God has prospered me. You know how God has prospered me. Okay. Uh, 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 for example, uh, uh, I was in Adioyo Church and I found myself in Okiado. And I know Adioyo Church, there are big spenders there. And then uh, you, you find yourself in a village and everybody brought out their 20, 20 naira or 50, 50 naira. And then you now brought your 1,000. After all, I have done better than everybody. You are deceiving yourself. Uh, I think we used to bring the uh, 
the children of the city is out. So that day is how the offering will look and, like. And uh, you know what they want to do. You know people that are my friends. They say, ah, we won't put our friends to our friend to shame. And you see, men were giving things that day. And, and Jesus you. was watching. Yes, and this woman, they brought, they call it might. I don't know if the amount of their money. And Jesus said, yes, this woman has given more than any other person. You know why? Because she has cleared everything. All the best that she has. Just to come and give unto the Lord. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And we are talking about, you say, eh, it's still part of the doctrine to one claim this in you. And they keep talking about the Old Testament. No, I don't know whether some of them, but I know they don't even read the Bible. It's told your champion, I think Otimari Lemetabi, when they passed on one, he said, passed on the on the social media. Okay? And you see, people listen to him. And they said, and one said, I don't give my tithe again since they told me that tithe is not biblical. Paul mentioned the church in Macedonia. And that is in the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 8 verse 1 to 4. Moreover, brethren, we do you to wit of the grace of God bestowed on the churches of Macedonia, how that in great trial of affliction, the abundance of their joy and their deep poverty abounded unto the riches of their liberality. Amen. Amen. For to their power I bear record, yea, and beyond their power, they were willing to give of themselves. Praise the Lord. I that church, you. Apostle Paul was talking about them that they were very poor. And out of their poverty, you see, I hear uh, some of our churches will say, Eshamokbe, you know, our life, you know, they don't have money. It is only in Lagos say that you have money. They say it does not have money. Amen. Amen. And you see, and uh, by saying things that shouldn't come out of their uh, of our mouth, we relegate ourselves, and uh, one way or the other, we stamp it that. And I confronted someone once. I said, Do you have so so church in I said, Do you have it in your town? I said, Is that church? He said, They have big church. I said, do they have money? I said, they have money now. I said, do you have your town people in that church? He said, yes, we know them now. And then I said, to every man that follows the biblical principle is the same result. It's the same result. The same result that you will get in Lagos is what you will get in the kitty. It's what you will get in Kogi. You know, I'm talking, you know, uh, Nigeria and Itaba IGR. But she raised the Wosi. I want you to know one Lagos, the lower Jew, Rivers, Kinikon. But I tell you, this biblical principle has not segregated, has not discriminated, is the same way everywhere. Be a bow of bear when you're saying, Power City, one lower city, one echo, Rivers, should be means of a pain, and not to be belly, yo, go yat a lot to become see, go me on. Emati, colleague, mini office, I don't know, need your con. Myself and my colleague were driving out one day. Lono Oba Fe. And we are driving towards our first side of this and of the machine. And there was a man on a motorcycle. Oh, Koja, or let me a wave. 
He drove by us and my friend waved to him. Oh, any customer or any woman? Yes, said that's our customer. Muko, we be okay. Agbalagba, Aruba. I said, an old man. Ah, bye bye bye, sir. Ah, only Agbe, any man here. He said that man happens to be a farmer. Eh, money and then. I said, I saw what? Only man here, any more than seven million. La cante. I said that. He said that man has more than seven million. I said, come. What kind of farmer is he? Oh, why unique ni bank to wo gbe he said he's unique with what he's planting ta fi do ba fe mo be si wo ti we got to ba fe that i was just thinking adugbo yi na lo na de wa in this vicinity olon de blessed le bi bo ni 7 million and account. he was blessed to the place point where he has more than Agbe 7 million in that e agbe de ni and he's a farmer and then i realized that is the same principle everywhere so wa wi pe la no kan na ni ni bi gogo everywhere ni bi gogo see at the end of today's message you cannot pick you can decide maybe what jesus have said there will always be poor amongst you and then just take it and stamp it or make up your mind that from today this is where i want to belong to in ba ta ba fi pare oro ile are e boya o ma wo pe jesus ku ti so pe awon ala ni won wa la rin yin boya pa yen lo fe wa bo ba de ti wa ni pa yen be ni ko ma ri ta bo fe wa ni pa pe ji pe ma 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 ni aluyo paul mention another church paul tu ba so ni pa ejo and that is the church in philippi o wa ni ejo to wa ni philippi in philippian chapter 4 verse 14 to 20 ninu we philippi o ri ke yin And, 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 Paul, and Paul was talking about them. Paul will want to say power. He 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 said they 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 surprised Apostle Paul. One year, let no. Oh yeah, Paul, let no see joy. He he said I have received from Epaphroditus the gift you sent. They are a fragrant offering, an acceptable sacrifice, pleasing unto God. And the next thing. From the depth of his heart, he said, "My God shall supply." Inye nikoni walaiko, my God shall supply nikoni. Oh, as I pray, 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 this is part of the Lord. Oh, Lord, Lord, this is. But see what they did. This is the Lord. This is the Lord. Oh, Lord, I should be Lord. You mean your prayers? Inye nikiku, inye nikoni. Oh, man, so I pray. Ah, call on for prayers. Inye nikiku. They were the only. They were the only church that shared with Apostle Paul in his in his hour of need. Some of you, you don't care about what happens to your pastor. Apala panu ye ko kote efe kani inko to ba ugo shele si olu shagu toni. Pastor egba do afuwa. Pastor pray for us. Mo pastor ko so ni ni lo lockdown. He said to me, mo pastor said to me lockdown. Oni ba ilara u baleju. He said that the time he was so patient. Only to rip one more joke. Why you want to stop one more? They travel was so dull. He said because the members could not travel to his site. Only four Sunday, they don't open by one more. What will not turn? He said the first Sunday they open. Ah, they said thank God, lockdown is over. It no, finished all this morning. Some don't even care about the pastor. I want to continue. You don't need Paul to shout to one more. Some has never, ever in their wildest imagination. I need back to me only. Because I don't have now. Remember the church in Macedonia. He said, out, out of the deep poverty. Out of the deep poverty. Amen. Amen. And kilo kon, kilo te next the apostle Paul she o gba adura yen fun won. And then the next thing is apostle Paul now pray for this church. She mo adura to ti inu wa. Do you know a very soothing prayer? Amen. From within. She mo adura to ti inu wa. You know those gladly prayer that is prayed out. Mo run ti church wa kan lodun kan. I remember one of our churches one year. Won ra moto fun pastor won. They bought a vehicle for their pastor. Nigba the pastor kokori. The first time the pastor saw that vehicle, he started crying. Nigba the pastor ki mic mole. By the time the pastor took the mic, awon to wa nbi ni jo yen wa ranti. People that were here you will remember that day. Omo adura yen. You know those kind of prayers. Show mo adura to wa lati. You know that deep rooted prayer point. Adura yen gbodo gba. Gladly prayer, they must come to pass and be answered. I'm talking about sacrificial giving. I want to talk about one man. One man. Uh, they call his name David. And David one day woke up in the night. David, Lord, you can't tell us no rule. And he said, "What was I doing? Ah, come. He me or more. But I should be shepherd now. And don't tell him I do carry." Darren, Darren. Myself a shepherd. 
Suddenly I found myself in the palace. And look at the ark of God. Under the tent. And David said. I am going to build a house for the Lord. And he called the prophet. And the prophet said, Go ahead. And as the prophet was leaving, and the Lord said, Go and tell David, Don't build me a house. Don't. But because David has taught in his heart, David has taught in his heart to build a house for the Lord. The Lord said, David. I am going to cut a covenant between you and I. Forever never. Your house shall reign as king. And you, you pick up the flag of uh, Israel today. He will move the flag Israel. He shield the Solomon Lumari. I mean, Moses Lumari. Titani, Titavid. He won't see the shield of Moses, but that of David. He said because he thought in his heart. Only to report the pain we are in our country. I want to build for the Lord. A permanent covenant was cut with David. What about Abraham? Kill a person in Abraham. God said, wake up Abraham, Abraham, your son, that's your only son, go and sacrifice him. And Abraham woke up the next morning and took off and went and he was ready to kill the boy. And God said, now I know. I know that I have a friend in Abraham. Let me read the, the message interpretation. That's Genesis, Genesis chapter 22, verse 15. Listen to God Himself. God said, I swear, <laughs> God's sure word, because you have gone through with this and you have not refused to give me your son. Your dear, dear son, I will bless you. Oh, I will bless you. If you not come if you come anymore, emphasize yo. Be very far right, don't stop yo. He said, because you have refused to give me your son, your dear, dear son, I will bless you. Oh, I will bless you. I will make sure that your children flourish like stars in the sky, like sand on the beaches. And your descendants will defeat their enemies. And all nations of the earth will find themselves blessed through your descendants. Because you have obeyed me. He will not call out his again. He did not go in. Why did you allow him to go in? So since he's a repay, oh, Papa, so he's a good one. Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, 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 the covenant Abraham changed permanently. And that is the day the covenant on Abraham okay, changed. Man, so, ah, ah. And for somebody to be saying it emphatically. Ah, you know when your mother was saying it. Hey, 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 uh, it's an obligation to God, and no, I, 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 because I'm, I'm watchful of my time. Benefit of giving. In the book of Philippians, chapter 14, I mean, chapter 4, where we read, verse 14. Apostle Paul said, Your giving goes into your account. And that was what he told the, uh, the, the church in Philippi. He said it goes into their accounts. He said it goes into their accounts. He said it goes into their accounts. He said it goes into their Another man, Timothy, but also so called lost in account. Another person that has such thing recorded in his account. Cornelius. It's Cornelius. <laughs> Amen. Amen. And the angel said, Angel, you are so. Your arms eh, has come before God like a memorial. 
chapter 3 verse 9 says honor the Lord with thy substance and with the first fruit of thy increase and so shall thy vans be filled with plenty and thy presses shall burst forth with new wine and giving cause you to be blessed because the Bible says it is more blessed to give than to receive. That's Act, Act of Apostles chapter 20 verse 33. Act of Apostles chapter 20 verse 33. He said it is more blessed to give than to if you are the type, everybody shall no man for any new church. Everybody, yeah, sister, why, yeah, sister, why, yeah, I only mean to leave me on the name. In the way, I shall want to tell you, you're going to get a little bit more. On your day, I like the people need you not to go. But I got a new job. You want to call in your book, but I'm full of full of full of full. Then I ask you why. He said, It's because I don't have. Do you know that widow could have told Elijah of where I am? I need a go to continue. He said, Remember that widow, I did she hates that way, that flower alone, they will have died. But Elijah said, first of all, prepare. And she obeyed. What are you going well, you love to connect from everybody. You know I don't have. That's your complaint. That's your excuse. I don't have. You know I don't have. You have to understand. Amen. Amen. When that widow went to Elisha. Elisha asked her, what do you have? What do you have? Kilo wa ni kilo wa God cannot bless anything in vacuum. He has to see something to bless. So if you are the type you collect from everybody, you pretend. Ah, eh, a problem, a problem, a problem, You are taking and you are increasing your poverty. Says it is more blessed to give. 
than to receive. So stop saying, I don't have. Because the Bible says, Everybody according to his means. Are you saying we fun odin di odun kon ori ko ki kon to tell you fun pastor me oni na oni? Are you saying for your own year you cannot even buy one and bottle of coke for your pastor? You oh, you're saying money every, I don't you, have. You see when I look at the psychology of our people at times. I'm sorry, I, 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 I take liberty to say it. Maybe because I'm not full time. So let me say it. Let me say it on their behalf. Let me tell you something that happened. I want to run to be a witness. In 1995. In 1995, people that are here, you will bear me with First convention, you will not be a be Hey, that is the primary Pastor school. We are there. We, <laughs> said we broke One pastor man the altar that day. He said he went to pray. If you don't think about that as he was praying, he went to pray for blessing. He said, One prophet told him, You cannot succeed. You are not taking care of your father. He said, the pastor said, which of my father? They're not taking care of your pastor. And that pastor came here that day. And said, we must raise money to buy a car for the GO. That year. I was somewhere sitting down at the back. I saw the passion, the passion of his soul, Lord. I was talking that day. And the magic was like me. Few people were beside me. They mocked me. I said, Who is that pastor? 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 You know what happened? I don't want to see. <laughs> I imagine some conversation. Because I still see them. Those people that are saying we don't have that time. You see, there are statements statement you don't make flippantly and carelessly. And you don't sorrow on joy and worry passion or love. The person speaking that day, you can see the passion of God on that minister that day. I pray, I, 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 comment I that man make. Please be careful of your utterances. Maybe you are even make. You, you you see some of us and we shut the door against ourselves. But when see a drama, we go beyond the balloon and then we go to she because we are not ready to pay no shot. Channing, yeah, yeah, yeah. The person we just shot. Oh, Marty, let me be. If we come over here, no matter the amount of prayer people now pray on him, the person will not be blessed because personally that person has shot him. Himself or herself out. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You know, uh, uh, Jesus said, I mean, giving causes us to stop in heaven. Yes, Jesus even said it. He said, lay up for yourself treasures upon the heart. I mean, lay not, but lay it in heaven. That's in Matthew chapter 6. Verse 9. I want to digress a bit. Why some give and are not blessed? Or why some are not blessed? I just want to speak briefly on this. You know, I reading and uh, a foreign uh, president once said he said I don't understand many of our Christians he said to me they seem to be the laziest people I have found in my life only they are so satisfied with low standard Unbeliever, to sorrow. This person talking is an unbeliever head of state. And you know that is embarrassing to be 
saying that about us. And you see, because you hear people, they pray for prosperity and pray, Oluwa, 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 well, you know, from one mountain to the other, and things still has refused to change. Oh, yeah, when you're one bad, we are Lord, 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 bless us, do this, do, do that. And nothing has happened. Amen. Amen. You remember Apostle Paul in the book of Romans, chapter 12. He said, Not slothful in business. Abby? Fervent in spirit. Serving the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Apostle Paul, my Rikoto son now. Apostle Paul used to see before he Ori Kokoni Joromu ni. He must have seen something in the church at Rome. O ti ra won ole kan be o. He has seen some people that are lazy there. He said not slothful in business. Oni ni ti se ti se ma se se ole. So you you see because I'm talking when you open, this thing is not you see everything we have said now. He she uh, Latin so, Abibo Latin so, or raw, 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 raw. And when you follow this principle, it has to work. Woman thinking now, we are telling you the word of God. Amen. Amen. So, hard work. Working smart. Uh, a boy came to me last week and said, I want to start farming. I said it's good. I said, what do you want to plant? Only cassava. He said, again. good. Which land do you want to use? One hectare. He said he has one acre. I said it's not even enough to feed you. And I quickly did the calculation. And I told him how much cassava I will get from. Uh, one hectare. I said, if it is even a year like this year, that cassava is even expensive. This is how much you will get. This one cannot sustain you. Liability. You will see the liability. If friend initially, what are you saying? But you know. Fortunately, okay, we so I job a zero. So thank okay. God is educated. We started calculating. How many together. tons? Lomari. Ton to make lomari men. Atiri, okay. And the profit is zero. Omar, Omar, bring cassava, be. You will plant cassava. Omar, lo herbicide, be. You will use herbicide, insecticide on it. Go the lo herbicide, be insecticide. Osha maroko. Shebi, you are going to uh, to make the to prepare the ground. By the time we calculated everything. When we look at all the cost involved. Oju e wale. In fact, it came to his senses. I said, can you see you are not smart enough? Some of us, we, we feel we work hard, but we are not smart about it. And then, uh, okay, I said, what are we planting this area? Is cassava. So you must plant cassava. You plant cassava. So you must plant cassava. No, you don't have to behave like me. Oh, no, no. Uh, but that is not actually my and then I say, I'm talking about why some have refused to be blessed. Our tongue. Keep your tongue from evil. You remember those people I said about now? The same way some of us we talk about our leaders, we talk about our pastor, maybe pastor talking about the senior pastor, a member talking about pastor and making flim pant talks. Back on on your polo poche mama so you need power daddy what have you lose your guitar? Oh, lose your guitar. Me and Papa to my son, you power lose your guitar. Listen to what you love. Listen to what Sam. Listen to what Sam. Listen to what Sam say about this. Bang, continue this time. So you power. That's Sam chapter thirty four. Oh, in that video, oh, you can you learn your gun. Verse twelve. Only will you want to enjoy life? Do you want to live long and have happiness? Then keep your tongue from speaking evil. Oh, so we pay. Only show fake bad do. Show fake enjoy. Do you want to enjoy life? Show fake enjoy people. 
Keep your tongue from evil. It's not everything you have to say. Keep your tongue. And then I, 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 I because I'm rounding up now. So God loves cheerful giver. I want you to make up your mind today. It is not on the pastor begins to whine you. We have to do this. All we have an expert. So you are able to whine our people. Go and talk to them. So we are going to If that pastor, if that brother comes out, ah, today we are going to contribute. 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 Ah, today we Oh, Let the Lord love a cheerful cheerful giver. Before they said this, it should be how are we going to go about it? Or something came to your pocket. Even without them telling you, you know that this is our need. So far, I be over for what's over. Like someone told them, "Oh, on don't get what you are." Don't wait. You are not sure. See, secret is killing you. I'm still praying, making Jalu Dada. But I tell you, there is no other secret. It's not prayer. He said, Give. Only people And it shall be given. As if it no other secret about it. And he said, He loves a cheerful giver. It's not until. It's not until ah, today. Uh, go, it we gather outside and offering. Oh, run, run, oh. Ah, it's a bylo. It comes into your meat. And uh, I call it oh, run, run. I, call it. <laughs> And the choir too. You know they have their special song. So to run, run. Because you know he's a he's a he's a he's a he's a, he's a, bar, he's a girl. Ah. Hey, just give them their own portion. Oh. You know they don't. You know how they give unto Satan. Oh, don't do me, oh Satan. And that's where you bring your tithe. And that is what you are wearing. Oh, to the pastor, my record. Oh, because the pastor will go through the record. You know their their book. How they used to mark it. Sister, let me show you. Sister, for three months you have not paid your tithe. Muyani. Ah, I borrowed it. The day you've been borrowing the tithe. Don't wait until someone winds you up. Ma, do you think that they are covered with your face? Oh, you are fair, oh, you need to be loved. Oh, Lord, say, cheerful giver. And you know, you, you, your children. Why would I want more? No, they must see it in you. What would I give you? No, eh? You got to wear funny offering. Why you want to give offering to your child? Oh, you go 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 go. You remove all the good ones, all the good ones. You now want to give that twenty naira. You don't rob, you don't move from. Then the mutilated ones is the one you don't want. You are telling your child. Show me how to answer for money. God is not important. Allah will shake Pataki. Okay, one thousand. Say welcome. One thousand. Say welcome. Five hundred. Two hundred. Say welcome. Two hundred. Say welcome. One hundred naira. Twenty. You talk to you. You talk to another teacher. The mutilated twenty naira. You are just told that boy or girl. God is not important. Amen. Amen. But why do you suffer more? But by the time you tell your child, ah, okay, often we don't fetch for long. Where is the offering you want to take to the Oyaga? Ah, I do really. He look at it, say, ah, I owe one thousand. I'm at home by hundred naira law school. A child that takes twenty naira to school, hundred naira to school. To a jail free, don't fully ten naira, be twenty naira. You not give that child ten naira. Need your Monday, we full hundred. Hundred naira on Monday. Need your Sunday, we full twenty. Sunday twenty naira for offering. That means Monday, why important you? Monday is important and better off than Sunday. You know we 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 affect the psychology of our children. And we now have to transfer some more here. You don't know how much we change and change and change our lives. We must not about to be mature if we transfer the same mentality to the child. Let the child know that ah, Olu watu shele. You think it is not God that has spared us for this last six months pandemic issue? The most powerful man in the world, uh, the president of America, Lee Jetanisi, who no longer did me. The American president tested positive three days ago. I think we protect get that. And God is protecting us. 
Shouldn't we be grateful unto this God? Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Oluwa fe oni ti. God loves a cheerful giver. Make up your mind today. I, I, I don't want to share, but let me tell you my experience. Many years ago, we came here. Lord, don't they say our city? Many years. Or do go for the say our city? Allah Shayori. Allah Shayori program to be precise. Baba son join. Ah, Baba Bao said it that day. Big book born to have fake the offerings on that for long wood. Could tell one long that you talk about my daddy. If they are not pleased with the offering they are contributing and they are not they are not are not amount, not enjoy, eh? you want to start contributing if you remember there you will remember I will come back and some of us came out that day ah, offering to mo no was enjoying the offering I said I want to be contributing I won't deceive you I'm not able to be doing it at, at that time in my own thinking but one way or the other offering is wrong me long but one way or the other it was I was making it and it's possible oh, no, my be is and God started opening Ah, that thing came back. Ah, Can you see this thing is increasing? We have to do double it again. And since that day, that's your journal. I have not looked back. I have not looked back. Uh, a sister came to my house one day. Could uh, you know lockdown? A sister was during this lockdown. And I met the man recently. I met the man also oh, okay. right here. Uh, this man that they mentioned about, I met the man. In this brother continued to build the house. Oh, about to finish the house. And November last year, the Lord spoke to him. You are not the one that will live in this house. And Pastor Eni, to back his soul, and that pastor said, Tell him about this story. He knows God's voice. And he said, Yes, sir. Okay, sir. He said, I'm sending a missionary. And they want to be real lower before that December. I'm going to send a missionary to you. They will come and ask you for a house before December. Hand it over to them. When I had that experience, I got moved. And this brother continued rushing the house. I have been able to see what you have to say about Paris, you know. Wait before December. Take out the plan when you are doing December. The owner is coming. I know that it's a full year work. I want to remember. I want to remember. And he told the wife, God have told me we are not. The, I just want to finish this house. But God said I'm not. We are not the one that will do that. They were baby. rushing the house when they told me. And then I said, Wait a minute. What do you know? Ha! Hey! God spoke. How long you saw? He later to fair party. He asked that you are about to complete. And go back in your said immediately I had him. I said, Only look you as a tall on best of phone. Yes, sir. Only Mugbasa. Only Abraham back book. Then Abraham believed. That even if he killed that son, God was able to raise him. That means that is the extent of the trust of the faith that Abraham had. And even if that boy I slaughtered, God was able to raise him. To raise him. And he said, I don't know what I'm saying. If I when we get home after killing, I will go and ask them. Have you handed over the key finally? Because he said I had him, and I said yes, sir. How many times, Lord, he said, How many times have you been told? I don't know. It's not God. It's not God. No, no. I was reading Pastor Kumuyi. Sorry, I'm mentioning names now. He said he told himself, he promised himself with the first cartoon back of Kora, Pastor Lumagun. He said, I want to find out for I am okay. Okay, I'm going to hand it over to him. So immediately he was able to buy that Volkswagen. He gave it to the pastor. He said, The first thing is, once he bought the Volkswagen, he got a loan, car loan from the office. And bought the car and gave it to his pastor. And then the other car he bought. They went for a crusade. And they got stranded. And then he sold the car again. This car problem, Pastor Kumu, you need to see. Just share we want. we Kumu, buy. The Holy 
spirit will open your eyes. Amen. Let's bow down our head to pray. I just want you to make up your mind and tell God what you want to do from today. It's one-on-one -on -one with God. It's not a, a congregational decision now. Just, just have a deal with him. What you are making up your mind to do. And uh, next year, come and tell me that I did it and it didn't work. Come back and tell me if it did not work. Make a deal with God. Out of your heart, I want to. Uh, uh, he has done so much. For me. I am not going. Uh, uh, it's not going to be difficult for you. Oh, yes, Lord. Oh, Lord Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Yes. 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 Want us to open our eyes and rise to our feet. Atifi hon, omo iniyo, onti ulu anfe. We have shown unto you, man, what the Lord wants. O she, ati oro, miserable and wet. Igbega ati resile. Upliftment and downlift. Today you must make your decision. What do you want to choose? Do you choose to progress in the blessing? Or to progress in the blessing? You have been long. You want to be miserable, but today we And you want to make a decision. That I want to leave the congregation of beggars. And I want to join the group who will be giving. Giving today as from today on. Will not be by force. I will not join people who contribute a peer group. I want to be in the position of heart. I am changing my offering right now. I want you to increase right now. Where you are, I want to change my decision. Or you are the group I have been living in. I want to enter in the community. I want to be I want to Abraham. He who stand in the bye 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 bye. To come out right now, come out right now. Pe lati oni ni bata bati ku oni no pada i. As from now, immediately will depart. All free me abresi i pada. My offering will change. Idame wa abresi jade. My tithe will come. Lati since he lo. As from when? Me oni ba lo no do i. Idame wa me mo. I will not share my tithe. All free me i pada ni no church. My offering will change. Me oni ba ba wa so. I'm 
I will not say I don't have. In my house, I won't say I don't in have. In the church, I will be the highest donor to work for God. Begin to come out. Begin to come out. Begin to, come out. Begin to, come out. Begin to make your decision. Yo, what I've been so happy for you. Have from when? I can do all things through Jesus Christ. Who gave me strength? I can do all things. I can do all things through Christ Jesus. And it will be a better for me. I will begin to do it. I will not be a better for me. Speak to God. Tomorrow, if you don't have cash, you can make transfer. And as well, tomorrow you are making all the akoshi. So offering on offering new creation. It is taking by the first Sunday. We no la mark by below la bubwe new creation loan. So tomorrow so, offering is. Ripe ito umule ni shoshi ye kuli walki la lambi. Eh? The type of offering you do dropping assemblies cannot work tomorrow. Ripe ye po onfamoni two hundred and. Praise the Lord. Make sure that you don't give ten error to your children tomorrow. Let's pray. Olorun wa adupe. Fun oro to ron jade lo wuro yi. Ti pa so eran ise re. Adupe pe oro oro re si wa. O gba adura fun awon eyan mi lo wuro yi ni o. Maybe on she chat the work with Luke Benuluni. Uba drop pela to ni lo. Oh, ni toro moluru ko Jesus. Amen. Elu no ti sora edin kan. Baba mu le lo wato ato ni mo le ato ni bo. Beggars at thirty five at forty toro kaki ole book. Betul tu ko ji pada loni, ubah jura ibu kolor oya ko wasuri le loru kajis. Lato ni lo tinsi ojo keta ni lo shu oktoba, akosi le re re tolor on kono pati le loni, si ibu kum oya ba loru kajis. When 
others will say there is a casting down, there shall be lifting for you. Amen. Your paws will never go dry. Amen. I want to Amen. Allah need you. We keep us so work. We walk with Shabbat Shalom. Let the Lord or down the corner. It down the road called Jesus. Mo ba dura, mo ba aruto se oya shi. Amen. Mo ba aruto ide money oya shi lo road called Jesus. Amen. It shall be well with you. Amen. You shall be like a watered garden. Amen. You will bring out your fruit in your season. Amen. Your leaf will not wither. Amen. You will flourish, will blossom like cedar of Lebanon. Amen. The blessing of God come upon you. Amen. Go and prosper. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Jesus' name. Amen. Let's put our hands together and go back to our seat. It is well with your soul.